Wrapping our news at five, business as usual. A park is back open while an accused killer is on the loose. Three Oaks Park in Lee County was shut down yesterday as Lee County deputies swarmed the area after a man was shot dead. A Wink News reporter Annalise Iraola joins us live from Three Oaks Park. And Annalise, a stark contrast from how the scene looked yesterday. What are people saying today? Lois and Chris, people are shocked and surprised that a deadly shooting happened here at Three Oaks Park yesterday. The Lee County Sheriff's Office says it's making progress in regards to their search for a suspect, now telling us they are looking for one male suspect. What a difference a day makes here at Three Oaks Park. From choppers and canines on Thursday to a grandpa pushing his grandson on a swing set on Friday afternoon. So I knew something was going on like when they stopped traffic in both directions. Bob Mansfield was trying to take his grandson to the park Thursday when he was turned around. And it's quiet and peaceful. Nobody bothers you down here. It's so cool. Mm -hmm. So that was just really a surprise. LCSO blocked off Three Oaks Parkway for for hours to investigate a deadly shooting at Three Oaks Park. Lawrence Barnett was also turned away. We were coming down the road and then cops were flying in um, and kind of stopped us and told us we couldn't come anymore. And we were asking what happened and they wouldn't tell us, so we knew it was something pretty bad. This gunfire caught on a nearby ring camera is what took a young man's life. LCSO says a man was shot multiple times in his car. He drove this median where he gunfire. died. Upset for the That's people weird. that had a loss, but shocked. This oh, usually a second, is a really quiet area, package, so it was, was like, really surprising mm -hmm. and disappointing too. It's tough. I mean, obviously you never want to see anybody go that way. You never want to see anybody go Anyway, we feel bad for the family because loss is tough, um, but yeah, it was shocking. LCSO says their detectives are making progress, now saying their suspect is a man. Few other details are being released at this time about the investigation or a description of a suspect. As of now, LCSO says they don't need the public's assistance, but if that changes, they will work with Crime Stoppers and get that information out. As soon as we have any updates, we'll be sure to let you know. Live at Three Oaks Park, Annalise Iraola, Wink News. Annalise, thank you.